Hello everyone, thank you so much for tuning in to my deck flip through and deck review. Today we're going to be doing the Native American tarot deck, but I'm also going to be recording videos for the Tarot of the Southwest Sacred Tribes, Tribes of the Earth by Victoria, oh excuse me, Violeta Monreal, and then also the newly released Desert Ill Illuminations Tarot by Lindsay D. Williams. So as some of you guys know, I am born and raised in New Mexico, and so I felt very drawn to these Native American themed, well this one is like southwestern theme, so there's some cowboy art in here and stuff. It's, there, it's really a cool deck. Um, but yeah, so I'm really drawn to that stuff. So, all right, let's get started. So. Uh, this deck is a vintage deck. Um, as you can see, my guidebook is real, and my t my deck box, my tuck box is really worn out, and so I actually uh, keep the deck in a tarot bag. So this is um, copyright 1982, and cre created by Magda Weck Gonzalez of Shawnee Heritage and illustrated by her husband, J.A. Gonzalez. The cards feature Native American history, symbolism, and folklore, including material re related to uh, by a Blackfoot medicine man, Harry Sparrowhawk. And so this has, um, the cards depict different aspects of daily life from a variety of Native American tribes, including Apache, Arapaho, Cherokee, Cheyenne, Chippewa, Comanche, Hopi, Huron, Inuit, Iroquois, Kiowa, Navajo, uh, Papago, Pima, Pueblo, Shawnee, Sioux, etc. So it has several, and it's by U.S. Games. So I'm sure you can find a copy of this on eBay. And then I also, it came with the guidebook. So this is, as you can see, a very extensive guidebook. And, um, and then we have, it also comes with this booklet as well. So a pocket guidebook. So this is loosely based on the Rider Waite Smith tarot deck. Um, but they've changed, so like in the Rider Waite Smith, um, the element of wands is fire, cups is water, pentacles is earth, and swords is air. But in this deck, um, let me see if I can get it here. They, the, okay, so blades is air, pipes is fire, vessels is water, shields is earth. But they have like a little um, correspondence here. And the direction is east. Pipes is south, vessels is west, shields is north, swords, wands, cups, coins. So yeah, it's got, and it says spring, summer, autumn, winter. That's a little different. That's the thing that's different. So usually wands is spring. Um, Uh, cups is summer, pentacles is autumn, and swords is winter. So that is different. That's a little different. That takes some getting used to um, for me personally. So just wanted to make sure you guys were aware of that just because I know I use it. Um, another thing that is different is the archetypes, um, the court cards. 
I, they have the matriarch, chief, warriors, and maidens. And the personalities, they have very specific personalities um, that are a little bit different than the traditional, um, you know, personalities that we have with the Rider Waite Smith tarot. So that is something else that needs to be studied when using this deck. So um, here's a description of the Chief of Blades, which would be the Chief of Swords equivalent. Um, let's see if I can have a little description here. So he's based on Geronimo or Geronimo, as people know him. I use the Spanish pronunciation <laughs> just because I'm used to that. So, uh, let's see here, highly intelligent. He has no concept or regret or remorse and is indifferent to the fact that he lost an argument or battle one or two minutes ago. His nature plus his chameleon qualities make him impossible to defeat. He is elusive and elastic and could easily be a cultist, an alcoholic, an addict, a humanitarian, a musician, or a religious fanatic. He finds it easy to deceive others and can acquire a reputation for great depth of mind. So, um, and it goes on like that for each uh, court card so just wanted to point that out to you guys if you guys happen to get this deck and uh, just you know something to study and take into consideration when using it you can use this deck like Rider Waite Smith if you want to you know because it is easy it's easy to make the transition to use it that way however it does have its own system so keep that in mind okay so we have the um, information card here then there is a medicine song. And you guys can pause this if you want to read it. I really like the card backs. It is reversible and there are reverse meanings in the guidebook. Okay, so here we are with the fool. Let me zoom, zoom in a little. The Fool, The Clown, Hostin Coyote is the Magician, Corn Maiden is the High Priestess, Medicine Woman is the Empress, Council Chief is the Emperor, the shaman is the hierophant. The lovers. The sled. Strength. The hermit. Medicine wheel. Justice. Sundance, Death, The Weaver, Temperance, The Devil, The Tower, The stars, the moon, the sun, judgment, the world, that's a dead body 
just in case you guys did not notice that. The world. Okay, so here we have, um, and then it's actually, this is the order that they have it in. So blades is usually winter, as I mentioned. Uh, usually swords goes at the back of the deck, so um, it's not in the same order. So one of blades, two of blades, three of blades. And see how this is mourning. That's the association is a little different than usually well, no, this is three of swords. Sorry, I'm confusing myself. I'm used to seeing the three of wands here. But um, so yeah, three of three of swords, three of blades is mourning. Four of blades. Five of blades. Six of blades. Seven of Blades, Eight of Blades. So as you can see, there are many very uh, similar associations. So Nine of Blades is Polygamy. Ten of Blades, Maiden of Blades, and actually I put these back into order because I had used them. So it actually goes, um, let me see if I put it in the right order. So it goes The matriarch is first. Matriarch of blades. The chief of blades is Jeronimo. And then we have the warrior of blades. And the Maiden of Blades. Ace of Pipes. Two of Pipes. Three of Pipes. Four of Pipes. Five of Pipes. Six of Pipes, Seven of Pipes, Eight of Pipes, Nine of Pipes, Ten of Pipes, and then Matriarch of Pipes, Chief of Pipes, Warrior of Pipes, and Maiden of Pipes. And now we are in the Vessels, Ace of Vessels. Two of Vessels, Three of Vessels, Four of Vessels, Five of Vessels, Six of Vessels, Seven of Vessels, Eight of Vessels, 
nine of vessels, ten of vessels, matriarch of vessels, chief of vessels, warrior of vessels, and maiden of vessels. And shields. Two of shields. Three of shields. Four of shields. Five of shields, six of shields, seven of shields, eight of shields, nine of shields. Ten of shields. Matriarch of shields. Chief of shields. Warrior of shields. And maiden of shields. So that's it. I hope you enjoyed this flip through. Thank you so much for watching. I will put a link in the description to the following videos, which will be Tarot of the Southwest Sacred Tribes and the Desert Illuminations Tarot. Thanks again for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, like, and share. Have a great day.